my crafties, it's Tree. I hope you're having a good and crafty day. I'm here with the project share for Coco Rosa Studio. I want to thank Coco Rosa Studio for allowing me to showcase their products on my channel. I really enjoy working with them. For, it's been over a year now, and their products are very good quality. They come in a timely manner and very well packaged. Um, their website is here, and I have a discount code. It is Tree25 for 25% off your order. All of this along with the um, product that I'm using today as well as um, the products that I had picked or were sent to me um, <clears throat> will be also linked in the description box below so check that out so this time I am working with a band-aid die look at that and um, it says get well soon or feel better soon so um, the band-aid itself is about four and three quarters of an inch and here it is about one and an eighth it's a really good size one a little bit bigger than I was anticipating but that's all right it still worked um, and this is about two and a half inches by hold on it's getting caught on something hmm. let's turn it this way where I can get those little lines do, 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 about one and a half so a uh, very good die now we all know that I am tree and tree tends to lose little tiny things I am here to say uh, I'm so proud of myself I didn't lose a single little thing so uh, this word die every single letter will cut out individually except the B and the E here those two are connected and usually when they have these little ones here those are the ones I lose and I can say I did not lose a single one all right so I'm pausing for noisy car that gets noisier <laughs> so sorry all right um, and this is my card I use the Cartabella toy box it's really cute um, so to get the band-aid to stand out just a little bit more because I used a lot of white in here, um, I did do the dot dash dot dash dot dash all the way around, kind of faux stitching. I did back it with white cardstock and I think that had I used blue it would have been better, but I didn't have a large enough piece. So to create that halo, all I did was stick my die over the uh, on the paper and then I traced it around with a mechanical pencil. I did the same thing with the Feel Better Soon, where I traced it with a pencil and then cut it out. And then I used the blue part that I cut out um, and I put it down. And then, kind of like a stencil, I fit the letters in so I would get the spacing right. However, you can see right there, I got a little low to the bottom there. I should have pulled it up a little bit, but that's okay. Um, I did tear the page, so the Band-Aid's holding it together so it can heal. And I think it turned out really cute. So, that's my project share this time. Um, I want to thank each and every one of you for your crafty love and support. And if you have not already, please like, subscribe, and ring that bell. Definitely leave a friendly comment below. And uh, yeah, those thumbs ups, I call them likes, but anybody can do that. And I am so grateful for those of you who do. Please help my channel to grow. And um, I will catch you in my next video. Until then, God bless you and yours. Bye for now.